other one. So I want to share with you what WAC 100 has said just a, a few days ago about Christian Rock and Bonnie Lachey and the pregnancy and all these circus rumors that are going around. I think that WAC 100 of all time in the time that I've been on this earth is the most disrespectful, hating man that I know on the internet. And it's really sad that he hates Krishan Rock the way that he does. It's giving me female tendencies with WAC 100. It's like, you know, you talk down so poorly of Krishan Rock, but you really don't have any reason to. You're trying to have control of the situation and you don't have control of the situation. And if Krishan was acting like a yes man, like everybody else to WAC 100, and letting him disrespect her like he does everybody else in a circle, she would be okay with him. Or if, better yet, allegations surfacing that he wanted her to sign with him, obviously you know she has some talent, you would have been okay with Krishan, but because things didn't go whack 100's way, he's like on a smear campaign. And there are other allegations that have been brought to my attention but without the receipts, I'm not going to even speak on it. But I can definitely, rest assured, believe some of the allegations that are being um, set forth upon WAC 100 because he is so bitter. He wants control of everything. He's a chatty patty. Uh, there were things out of anger that he even said that I'm quite sure Blueface didn't want uh, anyone to know, like he doesn't own that property blueface doesn't and WAC 100 does when WAC 100 gets mad he exposes everything i don't care gangster street talk and who's snitching on who and he's the biggest dry snitcher in the industry and he continues to you know stir up the pot because he thinks that he's WAC 100 and he's on top of the world and he's not and He's going to definitely get a run for his money because Krishan Rock is definitely going to rise to the occasion. She's going to show everybody, like we already said, that she is the shining light. She is the head of the circus and she does not know her worth. And the people that are hating, like WAC 100, they do know Krishan uh, Rock's worth. This is why they're hating on her. They're trying to eliminate her from the equation because she's not going with their equation. And Krishan Rock will come out in her own due time and speak with the public when she gets ready. And if she decides, even going against Blueface, to pop them bottles at those clubs and get those bags like Jaden Alexis is doing at the present time. She will come out and do it in her own time and she's not going to allow people, hopefully, to control that situation. Whack 100 or Blueface. Now, he was put on the spot when asked a question about Bonnie Lachey and this is how he answered it. Got a couple, a couple more. What up, what up, what up, what up? Is Bonnie Lachey actually pregnant with Blueface's baby? You believe this? Tell the we truth. actively pregnant now. I couldn't answer that question because I don't monitor. Or this first time I heard she was pregnant. It's yeah, all in the right. blogs. And... Waiting that, that baby, this child she had was his. That's not his child. How do you know? Because that child was already alive when we met her. She's part of season one. Oh, I think we're talking about like a baby that she's pregnant with right now, and not like an existing child, what right? what he's no, talking I, about. I didn't know she was pregnant. Um... I don't add seem to my knowledge they haven't been involved like that. Yeah, I mean I never heard of them having sex. I, I don't pay attention to the blue face soap opera close enough to know about that. Part of the circus. The circus, right. It's crazy that the circus is still going even when he's locked up though. Hmm. Because I mean somebody pointed this out. You ain't really heard a whole lot of Krishan talk since he got locked up, right? But what, what, uh -oh. what, what I always say in the whole time. And you fought me on that. What? That's not that. That's him. Yeah, right. I mean, I oh, she's oh, got oh. her own star power, but it would seem that the the universe is not shedding as much oh, light on her now that he's gone. From where? Okay, but don't you you're <laughs> disagreeing? You don't think that she has her own existing star power? I oh, like her. Oh, blue face. I think that if she got into oh, a relationship with some like NFL player tomorrow, I that she'd be all up in the headlines again. She just she needs a man to she offset her natural chaotic state. Where she exactly. go over there, exactly. spit on him, bust his windows, right? Snitching. They praise her for ratchet, right? Snitching. Star power. 
Hmm. The songs, the TV, the characters, all that, the marketing is Blueface. Give him his props, bro. Did you ask him about my proposal that I sent over? Uh, yeah, he said he'll get back with me. Okay. He called me today. Word. Let me know. Because I think it's a great idea. I'm, I'm out here just being the, the social media <laughs> engineer that I've, I've always thought that I could be. Yo, bro, you really got all some footsies with James? So, WAC 100 gets off the topic very quickly about Bonnie Lachey being pregnant. Also, he can't stand Krishan Rock. That's because we all know, everyone knows this, that if Krishan decides in her own time to just get up on here, even not listening to Blueface, she brings in an audience. She brings in a show when she does do shows. If she does go to clubs, she pops some bottles. She brings in the bag. She allegedly even has more money than Blueface. And right now, these days, WAC 100 is probably digging in his pocket and pulling out lint. And he's mad because he feels like Krishan Rock is a driving factor to all of the chaos that is going on in the circus. And the influence on Blueface quiet is kept and why Blueface fell off. So, of course, he's going to throw salt on uh, Krishan Rock's name. That's all he knows how to do is throw salt on Krishan Rock's name. But for him to try to downplay it like he didn't hear nothing about Bonnie Lachey being pregnant is uh, BS. He knows that he heard about it. He knows that he's not buying into it just like us. He could have just cleared the airway and say, in my opinion, I think that girl's all cap. But no, he don't have no smoke with Bonnie Lachey. He's getting back at Krishan Rock by not saying nothing bad about Bonnie Lachey, but talking mess about Krishan Rock. See, that's how people do. That's why I said he's giving me these vibes of shadiness. You know what I'm saying? He's a chatty patty. Chatty patties always have an answer for everything. But he sure enough answered very negatively about Krishan Rock. He didn't have a bad thing to say about um, Bonnie Lachey. And he knows that Bonnie Lachey is going around here with the fake news that she's pregnant. And if she is, in fact, pregnant, good luck to her. She's not going to get treated any better than Jaden Alexis or Krishan Rock. So I don't know why she thinks that she's this princess, why she's going to get this special treatment. If it's true, he's going to treat her just like he treats the rest of them. And that ain't much. And WAC 100 is behind it. But I bet you whoever he lays with at the end of the night... He's treating her like a queen, but yet and still the people that Blueface are involved with, he's, you know, disrespecting. And Blueface, as a man, a young man, needs to put his foot down and let him know the boundaries, but he's not because he thinks this is all cute. He's probably also intimidated by WAC 100, quiet as kept, kept low-key intimidated by WAC 100. He doesn't know how to bring it to him that uh, he shouldn't be disrespecting any of the ladies that are in his life. Whether he's playing with their head or not, it's not his place, WAC 100, to be disrespecting anyone that's in Blueface's circle. Period. Point blank.